more than whether or not graffiti is gay. Okay, well, I, th I don't even think that's homophobic. I think it's just somebody trying to be contrary and uh, and there is Romeo. There's that's a pretty well placed uh, piece of graffiti. Okay, now. Sounds like we've got some people coming through. So I will try to take some footage. Okay. And little kids. The carrier. I'll turn my headlamp on. Hey kiddo. What's your dog's name? Ori. Ori? How you doing, Ori? Pleased to meet you. Okay. Here comes Mickey Mouse. Okay. You're in the movies. Mickey Mouse, M-I-C-K-E-Y-M-O-U-S-E. -E. Mickey Mouse. <laughs> <laughs> okay, stupid dad. I'm stupid dad, not that guy. <sighs> My jokes are stupid dad jokes. Okay, and it's dark here once again. Glad I have my helmet, my headlamp. show the rocks here which I guess have fallen from the ceiling something to think about okay let's see it doesn't show up when it's your time when those rocks falls on your head Here we are, tunnel, entrance, tunnel entrance. Since I'm gonna be talking more in these videos, I'm gonna work on my, I'm gonna say diction, my enunciation, diction. Correctly enunciating the words. Okay, I'll show you some of the rocks, okay. These are the rocks that have fallen down from the ceiling. Okay, that's a monster. Huh. Huh. That is a monster. Well, yep. there's the other end. Okay. I guess they tried to bury it in. Okay, there you have it. The tunnel at Glen and Oco in Lehigh Gorge State Park. Okay, this is the beginning of where we plan to hike. This is the upper parking lot of the in between lower chunk and upper chunk. Uh, it's a good place to park, it's always free. Uh, the trail goes up that way towards Mudchunk Lake, and it goes down that way towards downtown Jim Thorpe and Asa Packer Mansion. And we shall begin. Okay, here we are at the first stop. Uh, we're coming up on the cemetery. Uh, you can tell because of the dead trees. Okay. Uh, 
lots of dead trees here and here we have the the switchback house uh, this guy built it started building it probably 20 years ago when I saw the first bags of bricks I wonder where he got the bricks I bet you got them from for free from New York City or something okay there you have it the switchback house After this is the cemetery, St. John's Cemetery, Machunk Cemetery. Here we go. That is the switchback house. Okay. There is another subterranean entrance. And the more I hike, the better my my wind capacity gets, my aerobic capacity. So here is another dead tree, which I would like to know the name of these special tree assistant professor, University of Georgia, Athens. What is what kind of tree is this dead tree? The bark is amazingly thick. Yeah, I think they're hickories. Maybe that, that's what happens to hickory trees when they get old. Okay, and then you can see there's St. John's Church and the spire of the barge's tombstone in the distance. And we'll, we'll be going just below that and uh, downtown my chunk is right down there. Okay, there's the graveyard. We're hiking below it. Here's the wall. Okay, there's the tombstone right on the edge of it. For Douglas, born 1867, died 1902. Okay, this is about a quarter mile into the trip. Uh, the whole trip altogether is uh, 2.5 miles. Okay, this is the back side of the cemetery where the Lysen ring and all the big tombstones are. Mary Carter paints. This is the end of this trail. Okay. It ends in a parking lot behind somebody's house. And it goes down Packer Avenue towards the Ace of Packer Mansion and the Jim Thorpe Courthouse. There is a coal car. That is the kind of car that would roll down in the mines on these small steel rails. Okay. And what we have here is car's been here at least 20 years so you know their deadline for fixing it up is far in the future it says 814 so the last time it was inspected was August 2014 okay or August 2013 okay here's the end of this part of the trail We'll head down the hill towards Cameron Park and Asa Packer Mansion. Okay, we are heading down the hill towards the Asa Packer Mansion, uh, but there is this turnoff here that goes into Cameron Park, uh, which is a nice way to go down the steepest part of this hill. This is pretty easy to slip. Okay, there is a good view of the courthouse. to cell towers. I'll take a shot of that. I'm gonna say that's a 911 and 10 on the top of the mountain. Yeah. Where is it? There it is. Yeah. That is not a cell tower. 
That is a 911 repeater. Pretty good spot. Okay, now we're going to head down this path. Sorry for turning so quickly. Here's the wall. Maybe I'll take you down the path with me. All right. <clears throat> you see the pretty, I don't know what the purple flowers are. Uh, we'll leave that to the naturalists. Mary Beth, Jenny, who are the naturalists in our family? Well, Jenny's, yeah, she's in our family. Okay, somebody, I think that's an Airbnb, that house down there. Oh, I always see different cars down there. Uh, this is Camera Park. Okay, you can see we just did a little switch back. Kind of pretty here. It's a nice day too. It's about 60 degrees. I have a sweater on. There's a nice lumpy sycamore tree. Yeah. I guess people could use this video for um, advertisements for Jim Thorpe, maybe, if they're thinking about coming up here. You can see there is a basketball court. Uh, there's the basket. Okay, it's a full length court, too. There's the other basket down there. Yeah. You can play basketball and tennis. Um, Wherever the basketball person is in the family, guy or girl, man or woman, they can play basketball while you watch the kids in the, on the swing set. You can see uh, there are swing sets for the kids in diapers. Uh, so I wonder if there's some Duke in there. Who knows? Maybe TMI, right? Huh? Okay, and then this is some sort of hangout. The kind of thing that rich people like is cool shade, lots of it. Uh, oh, apparently there's a library. Maybe that's what that building is. It's a library. The Cambridge, the camera. Carriage House Library. Okay. And I think I will take you through the playground, really. There's some more nice flowers, little doodads. Everything's in bloom this time of year. Okay. Whatever those bushes are. Mount Laurel. Looking forward to that. Quince, maybe. Some bad memories of a quince bush I tried to remove. Okay, there's the basketball court, playground. There's the parking lot where you gotta pay. Here's the swing set for the big kids. Boy, you could, if they jump off at the right time, they can make it all the way to the highway, Route 209. Yeah. Okay, ooh, here's another little slide. Kids to climb, pretty bushes. Uh, I wonder what this looks like to a tourist. But to a cell tower guy, yeah. See that equipment on the roof? Yeah. That means that the cellular equipment's inside, and the cell tech doesn't have to climb outside on the roof to to get to it. There's the antennas through the trees, you can't see them, they're brown, painted brown.